whenever I'm ready, I can do it. Okay. Do I have to talk before or I just play? Okay, I'm sorry. <laughs> I think everyone has songs that save their life. Anything can inspire anyone at any second. I think everyone writes songs when they're little. Something happens when you're young and you stop singing and you decide you can't sing or play music. A, a teacher or someone of authority discourages you if you're lucky enough to have any teaching in music or maybe you go to a school, there's no instruments, there's not even a piano when you're little. What is music? What is art? What makes something music and something not music? I remember when I was little and I was lucky enough to have a music theory class, someone played a major chord and a minor chord. And minor chords sound sad, major sounds happy. That's an opinion, but that's an opinion I was brainwashed into believing. So I feel sad and happy from those chords, but the melody can change all of that, and a minor melody can make me happier than a major melody can. Like a lot of Jewish music, I play a lot of klezmer music and Jewish music, and a lot, I'm an atheist, but I love the culture of it, and a lot of it's minor, but it's happy, and it's celebration songs. So it's so complicated. I think sad songs uh, can make me happier than anything, because it's proof that someone else felt that way too. And I think Feeling lonely is very a strange feeling because it feels like it's only you when it's happening, and it feels like no one else feels this way. 
and then you hear your friend felt that way that same hour of the day at same time your friend was crying alone in their room too um, and that's why I love Elliot Smith for example um, because everyone was like oh he's so sad he's so whiny he's so sad but it makes me happy to hear his songs because they perfectly depict some feelings that I feel in my everyday life that I never heard in music before actually not to say anything is better than anything else but that's what got me writing songs his music it made me feel like I wasn't alone in this way that nothing ever had before I think everyone is a poet and a songwriter and a singer it's a different kind of language my songs have words songs I love have words other music I love doesn't have words like symphonies and experimental improvisation music doesn't have words so words you know they can help what I'm trying to say is writing songs is helps people like the act of writing it helps me and I kind of write my songs as reminders um, of hard times I've went through because sometimes I'll forget um, sometimes when something's really traumatic you forget if you know what I mean like you block it out but sometimes that causes me to repeat mistakes I guess I think everyone has mental health issues I mean I don't I don't know if I you know you're not in anyone's brain everyone suffers pain and that's mental health issues I've been diagnosed with things I don't know if I believe any of these terms just because I'm mentally sick doesn't mean I suffer more than anyone you know I don't believe suffering there's a scale and you can measure your suffering someone else's so I'm not trying to say any of this like oh woe is me but I am a drug addict and I do have technical mental health issues and the song has helped me not uh, use those substances since I wrote it and uh, I think it, it could help someone else to write a song about something that happened to them. If you're struggling, please ask for help, because you're great. <clears throat> and uh, listen to Louis Armstrong. That's what I have to say. <laughs>